Today is Thursday, December 13, 2007. This is the Mindanao Examiner Internet Broadcast from Southern Philippines. And now for the news. State teachers working in the autonomous region in Muslim Mindanao have complained about delayed salaries and others non-payment of wages the past months. There are also allegations that tens of millions of pesos in contribution to the state pension plan is missing. But regional government officials have strongly denied all the accusations and say teachers are receiving their salaries on time. They blame provincial school superintendents for the woes of the teachers. Who is saying the truth is a big question, but many teachers in Sulu have already walked out of their classes to dramatize their protest in their problems, blame on corruption. Teachers are left penniless with no money for their families and a bleak future for many who depend on a meager salary, a sharp contrast to billions of pesos lost to corruption in Filipino government schools. These teachers from Sulu spoke to the Mindanao Examiner, and this is what they say. So I am Mr. Nolong Yemarak, uh, District Supervisors of Maimbong District. So we are appealing to President uh, Arroyo the following problems. Uh, uh, one is uh, the expiration of the CP of the provisional teachers have been started this year and by 2009. More provisional teachers uh, will be terminated. Questions. Who will handle the classroom with complete elementary school with only one teacher permanent in status and having a possession of TIC and head teachers? Two, the lead of salaries of permanent teachers, especially during the season of Ramadan. Three, the highest and forgiving non-remittance of premiums to include membership and loan payment of which deduction are being made monthly in the regular payroll. I am Mrs. Leticia Estan, the teacher in charge of Mindbung District. Uh, most of all, the problems of my teachers are the delay of salaries and the permanency of my teachers because most of my teachers are provisional. Yes. The permanent teachers are receiving the salaries but then delayed, always delayed more than a year. And then the provisional teachers, some of them do not receive their salaries until now. With cameraman Arthur Abasolo, this is Al Jacinto reporting in Sulu Province for the Mindanao Examiner Internet Broadcast.